<laughs> wow. It's your boy out here, Boom Boom Tisk. Thanks for tuning in. We're out here with the EK Civic. As you guys may know, I've been doing a lot of work to get it prepped for the track. A lot of things here, just put a B16 in it, and um, just other stuff, tires, brakes, everything to get it going smoothly around the track. And here we are today trying it out. We just got back today from our first run session of the day. I'm still running beginner group, so still getting a feel for the track, getting to learn it. Um, car's running good. We did have our first spin out this morning. Uh, I was following a, another car on the track and they spun out in one section and I was forced to make some evasive maneuvers and I spun myself out as well. But besides that, everything's okay. Car checks out. Uh, just a little scuffs on the side skirt, but it's a race car. So it is what it is. We're gonna go back out there. I'm gonna try to get some in-car footage too this time. And let's just have a good day. Except for the lift supports.
saw the fast guy is about to go up. Alright you guys, it's about 3 o'clock or so, it's getting a little late in the day. We have one more run session to do and then we will be done. Uh, this time we're uh, doing a ride along here and maybe I'll get a PB today like I did last time with passenger in the car because that's the secret. But either way, it'll be fun. Um, that way she will also get to learn a little bit of the track and its layout for future purposes. But besides that, we're, we got about 20 minutes to the last session. Um, the EK Hatch is doing really good today. Um, last two sessions have been running pretty smooth. Uh, motor feels nice and healthy on the straights. It sounds great. Um, new clutch feels good. I did put it a clutch in it last week. So um, I did break it in as well. Hopefully it's broken enough for today. But I mean, yeah, the car feels great. I feel like a lot more, could go a lot faster but again, that just takes time and um, we'll see how this last session goes.
odds? He survived. Yo! How does that always happen? This is JDM John. JDM John brings his child to the racetrack. Be like JDM John. you guys so we are all wrapped up for today uh, EK is still in one piece so we will be driving it home no trailer this time but besides that it was a really good day today we actually hit our uh, personal best day on that last session with the ride-along I guess that is the secret if you have a ride-along maybe I, I don't know but we got a minute 19 point oh, I'm sorry two minutes 19.6 so that's a big improvement. Um, I broke it. I broke a uh, minute, a uh, two minute twenty. So I'm pretty happy about that. But uh, definitely got more room to go faster. The EK uh, for the most part did really well today. It's got little things that it does need in the future. Um, I do gotta probably refresh the suspension. Um, tie rod ends I think are are due, and it's got the original tie rod ends on. I haven't changed them yet. So we're gonna do that. Um, it's got the new clutch in there, Action Clutch Stage 2. Shout out to JHP USA for getting that to me really quickly and in time. So that we, we got that in there and it's broken in, I think. So we did that. We got the motor in there. The B16's up and running super healthy. The Chip P28 ECU is in there, which we did have an issue with this week. I was actually stressing because we did a San Francisco trip with the car. And then when we got back home to San Diego, after I parked the car four days later, it wouldn't start again. And so I, I was like trying to figure it out. I did the fuel pump on it. I actually um, hit up Lee and Lee hooked me up with his um, OEM GSR fuel pump. So we threw that in there. And main relay, all the, you know, all the basic stuff is still didn't start. Ended up being the ECU, but shout outs to, I will plug his name in here, but he was very quick into um, looking into the issue with the ECU that I had. And he sent me a replacement, which arrived just in time to make it to this track day. And so it showed up last night, I plugged it in, we drove it three hours, no problem, and we beat it up on the track. So it's a whole event just getting to this event, which is like every track day. Um, if you don't know, you will know, but I just gotta say shout outs to everybody, especially this this one right here. Yeah, and um, just all support from uh, friends and fam. But yeah, we're um, looking forward to more events next year. It is December, so this will probably be the last event of the year. But I could say that we definitely had a good one. So, till next time, peace out. And yeah, happy holidays. <laughs>